Hello, I'm Jerry Ford, the Beer Review Guy, and we got my guest over here, old Wayne. Hey, what's going on? There's a lot of you that know yeah. know of Wayne. He brought a he brought a beer over to review with me. Um, this is the Prairie Artis, Artisan Ales, the Bomb. Um, I reviewed this five years ago, um, so he uh, he didn't know it. But brought it over in a chance that I never reviewed it before. But so this is just going to be a revisit. Yeah, I'd never seen that before, so I thought maybe he hadn't tried it. But I knew I was taking a chance. <laughs> <laughs> this is one of the best. This is one one of the best uh, stouts that I've ever had. One, one of the best. Um, this is the bomb. Uh, Imperial Stout aged on coffee, cacao nibs, vanilla beans, and chili peppers. Um, Spaceship Earth Coffee Company. Uh, is I guess that's who contributes the, the coffee part to this. Prairie Artisan Ales is the brewery, and they are here in Oklahoma. Oh, they really? Mm -hmm. oh, I didn't know that. Krebs, Oklahoma. Uh -huh. um, so this is a 12% ABV. The one I did... Five years ago was a 13% ABV. Um, let's see, any more information? You want to tell them how much it was? Uh, it was uh, $7.99. Whoa! I think $7.99. $8. <laughs> it's pricey. It's a pricey one. I, I think. I did. I I think I bought that one for like six dollars back then, twenty sixteen. Oh, probably so. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, so it's been sitting out of the refrigerator for about thirty yeah. thirty minutes. Probably so. Something like that. Yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna check that. It's been a while since I've had a had a porter. I mean a stout. So. That's a big, that's a big catfish right there. Oh, yeah. I'll be done. You got his mouth gaping open there? Mm -hmm. Looks like he's got oh, a cigarette yeah. in his mouth. Yeah, it too. does, don't it? Yeah, yeah he does. He's got a <laughs> cigarette in his mouth. Really? Yeah. Oh, dude. Yeah. It not being a bottom feeder ain't bad enough. <laughs> uh, Look at that head. It's all cocoa-y looking. Ooh -wee, that'll wake me up. <laughs> yeah. Or that. knock you out. Yeah, set that gummy on. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Uh, man, that's darker than Guinness. I know it. Look how chocolatey uh, it looks. I know it. Oh, my goodness. We're going to have to do that one night. Have you ever had like a Guinness and a, uh, another beer mix? Yeah, that's the black and tan. Yeah, make the black and tan. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. First time I had that, I was in uh, South Carolina uh, with with my wife and uh, and our our little brother was there too. And our little brother passed away eight years ago or something like that. Yeah, Carrie Dean. Yeah. yeah. And his wife was it? Was yeah, they were married. Well, they were together then. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that was been long time ago. It has. About, you remember? What, about 30 years ago? 25, 30 years Something ago? Something like that. Wow. Yeah, we, got, we went to uh, Tommy Condon. Very good. Yeah. It's a uh, angel and I, my wife, while we go down there every year for our anniversary. Um, but yeah, they make some good beer there. You know, they're stout. Yeah, we had those black of tans. We sitting at, up at the bar drinking Ooh. those things. Yeah. They were, I, I sat, sat there for the longest time. First time I went to go to the bathroom, I about fell over. I was like, uh, they kick your man. <laughs> oh, man. You get a good smell yeah. of that? Yeah. Stick that I'm nostril. I'm good smell of it. Now I want to taste it. Cocoa, <laughs> chocolate. Man, is that just rich? 
those cocoa nibs in there. Is that what it is? Mmm. Mmm. And the vanilla, it was like vanilla beans? Yeah, well, yeah. Yeah, vanilla beans. Mm. Now, let's see, can we get that chili pepper? The chili, the chili peppers in there? A little bit, because it's burning. Ooh, yeah. They're kind of on the back end there, aren't they? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. yeah, you get the coffee, a little bit there, and a little bitterness on the back end, like I a little coffee bitterness. Taste the coffee. Mm. Yeah. The alcohol is kind of, uh, it's, it, it, I yeah. Mean, it's, it's strong. I mean, I could feel it like I took a shot or something. You feel it, but you oh, don't yeah. much taste it, though, do no, you? No, 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 but not much taste, but boy, I feel it. Wrong. <laughs> I got that warming went down into my... Yeah, it's good, stuff. but not a beer I'd want to sit there and drink a six-pack of. That's for sure. These are not meant yeah. to be drink up. Yeah. They're not what you call sessionable type beers where, you know, where a low ABV beer that you're just sitting outside and enjoying yeah. six of them. These, these yeah. being that big of an ABV. What's the ABV on it? 12%. Oh, wow. You said the other one you tried was 13 percent. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. You know why? I don't know. No, they don't. Kind of, kind of weird. Yeah. That it was a little bit more. Yeah. I guess maybe uh, batches maybe come out a little bit, you know, 12, 13. So that could they be. They got to put it on there. So that could be. Yeah. Otherwise, they'd have to add a bunch of stuff to it to try to bring the mm. ABV down. Yeah. Right. And then in which you're messing up a batch if you're trying to to do that. So yeah, exactly. The people are going to pay. Taste this. is going to be wrong. All right. Yeah. People will pay. You know, that can that can afford a really good tasting beer yeah. like this. They'll pay this price for it just to uh -huh. enjoy it. Um, you know, occasionally. Um, yeah. But uh, th these are. A lot of people buy these from the winter time just to kind of warm you up, but yeah, kind of winter yeah. time beers. Yeah, yeah, that's but, true. Yeah, that's that, that, that's exactly true. I'd want it to be real cold out to drink another one of these. Yeah. Right. And I'd like it to be colder. Forget <laughs> the room temperature. <laughs> I want it to be cold. Oh man. Mm. Good stuff, huh? Woo, boy! It's got a kick though. Yeah. Ah. Got a yeah. light sweetness to it, light yeah. to mid sweet. It's almost too sweet to me. You know, on the back end, yeah, it's like it's wrong. A little sugary. Yeah, too sweet. It must be some kind of what is it? Molasses in there or something? Um, it does kind of put off a little bit of that kind yeah. of characteristic. Um, mm. But I think it's just the mixture of the, the cocoa nibs and the vanilla beans oh, is yeah. where the sweetness oh, part is coming in. Yeah. Mm. Oh, Out aged on the coffee. Something of vanilla beans. Vanilla is sweet too. Mm hmm. And chili peppers. That's just weird, ain't it? Mm hmm. Just to give it that kick, I guess. I'm getting a little bit of a taste. I'm not myself getting like a like a heat, yeah. like from a spicy. Yeah, heat. I guess mine just kind of. Of course, I haven't eaten anything today. I had a uh, big mistake. Carnation and some breakfast, so I'm dumping this on top of the meal. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, it's good though. Yeah. But it is. It is a um, <clears throat> coffee or cocoa sweet. To me a little bit but mm -hmm. it's different though it's one of those like you said maybe in the winter time you know have one mm -hmm. so, might even uh could just add it to some coffee and so have a cup of coffee and mm -hmm. put a little creamer in it you know or this this, uh, this being sweet it might kind of yeah, uh put sweet, off a yeah. little bit of a a kind of a creamer taste to a maybe coffee so. maybe so Huh, that's an idea. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, thanks for bringing us, Wayne. Yeah. Well, you're welcome. I'm glad it's been a while since you tried it. Yeah. So. Yeah, this is a nice one to revisit. Yeah, but y'all give us some feedback on uh, on what.
what if you've tried this or what you think of it because um, I'm sure everybody has their own taste. Oh yeah. So, I know of one person that's gonna yeah. probably say something. That's Stephen Bush. He's oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. he's uh, Oklahoma, near Oklahoma City. I don't think he's in Oklahoma yeah. City, but he's he's had a lot of these prairie. Yeah, probably close. Probably not too far from. Him, you know, mm -hmm. I think he's actually the one that might have told me about this yeah. beer back when I first started doing reviews. Oh, yeah. Probably yeah, told me to try this. So. Yeah. Okay. All righty. Well, thank you all for watching. We appreciate it. And we will see you on... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, I don't know if you all seen it or not, but Oregon beat Ohio State today, 35 to 28. So, uh, I don't know who's... Uh, <laughs> Jerry ain't big on football, but... But as you can see, I like my Tigers. So, uh, but y'all have a good one. Uh, enjoy some football tomorrow. All right. See you on the next one. Bye.